Hall of Fame Pan American Athletic Director Jim Brooks had what the Monitor termed a big brick dream, to build the largest indoor arena in the Rio Grande Valley. And after 19 years on the job, Brooks' dream finally came true as the $1.9 million field house finally opened in 1969. Dubbed the Brick Basketball Palace, the field house has played host to nearly 2,000 basketball and volleyball games and sports camps over the years. It hosted four NBA games in the 1970s, welcomed the Harlem Globetrotters to town, and featured an Oscar Robertson clinic. There have been numerous postseason competitions at the field house in recent years, and it even hosted professional tennis in 1977. For decades, the field house has served as the premier concert venue in the Valley, hosting stars such as Cheech and Chong, Hughes Corporation, George Strait, Huey Lewis and the News, Cheap Trick, Roberto Pulido y los Clásicos, and Julio Iglesias. The field house has brought national attention to the Valley, as in 1987 it was the site of a nationally televised presidential primary debate, the first such debate held in South Texas. It's a historic event for the Rio Grande Valley. We thank the Southwest Texas County Judges Association, and we thank you for watching. Good night from Edinburgh, Texas. A multi-purpose space, the field house has also been host to dance performances, conferences, banquets, expos, job fairs, and an array of impressive speakers such as Bill Nye, America Ferreira, and John Legend. There have been many renovations over the years, including upgrades to amenities such as new seats and video and ribbon boards, several court redesigns, and now the latest, the upcoming 15,000 square foot atrium that will feature a new concession stand, the team store, a Hall of Fame area, and more. This is your field house. This is home. Welcome home, Vicaros.